Welcome back to the show! Yeah. 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 Jeff, season two, episode... Season two, episode 16! 15! 15! Yay! 15. Welcome back, everyone! Good one, Jeff. <laughs> I know, I did it. <laughs> Who are we? Let's introduce ourselves. Who are you? Um, I am... The Senators. The Ottawa Senators. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Hey, Jeff. How are you? Who are you? I'm the Boston Bruins. Oh, hey, Pete. How's hey, it going? Good. I'm the New Jersey no, Devils. No, I'm no, Olivia. No, 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 Ottawa. Noel no has no hockey team. Noel oh. would be the Anaheim Ducks. Yeah. Yeah. Mighty Ducks. With the possums. With the possums. Yeah, don't know the possums. We don't know them. They're below the ECHL. Yeah. They're in the junior league. Welcome back, everyone. Hi. 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 Hey. We're back after our last week, our hey. 2020 hey. Drivecast anniversary episode. Or 20th anniversary episodes, excuse yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we got a couple more days leading up to our gala coming up on Saturday, January 25th, 2020. Yeah, for way. Strive's 20th anniversary. So see you there. More information is available on our website, pslstrive.org. The whole Strivecast fam will be there. We will. And we have a special surprise planned for Strivecast. An in-person listeners. appearance. Yeah, that's right. We'll sign autographs. Well, Pete and I won't, but Jeff and Noel and Susie will, and Ryan, Ryan and you know, that's right. that would be a dream to meet them, I know, so Money. see you there in your formal wear. Money. Boom. Let's we'll check there. in. How we doing, guys? Everybody good? Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. I'm doing great. Good. We're good. Right? Yeah. yeah. I'm right. doing good, too. I'm doing, I'm glad you're doing well. That's right. Excited for the anniversary? Very. Yeah. It's going to be a great time. Can't yeah, wait. it is, Pete. It's going to be really, really great. Yeah. Thanks, Jeff. What dance move are you excited to do, Jeff, on the dance floor when you get there? Oh, um, uh, me and Pete have a little uh, dance number that we're going to do. <laughs> oh, you do? Oh, yeah. oh, we do? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we do. What uh, song are you going to do it to? Um, I, I think it's, it's going to be a, a little... Um, um, uh, I can't tell you about that yet. Surprise. But, um, gotcha. Yes. Are you going to do your signature butt-to-butt -butt move that you like to do? Uh, no. With other people who aren't Pete? No. No, we're going to keep that one out. Or with Pete, for the yeah. record. <laughs> I do have a memory one. Oh. Oh, here we go. Carried over from the last memories. show. memories, yeah. When we had it at the uh, Holiday Inn. Remember the Michael Jackson Swallow dance at the end? It was... The auction. The auction. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yes. Cool. Yep. Was that fun? Yeah. Great. You can do the thrill dance so if you so want. So if to. Jeff doesn't have a tuxedo, w w then what dress is he going to wear? I believe he's going to wear a suit. A birthday suit? <laughs> oh, but I'm both. <laughs> nope, just no. a regular suit. suit. It's still going to be a January. I did not right? say that. <laughs> Don't blame that on me. <laughs> anyway, it's going to be a great time. The yeah, Wavelength right. Band is going to be there. Big tunes. Playing live. Um, no, it should, right. should be a lot of fun. Great. So. Can't wait. <laughs> All right. We've well, got a great guest today. Yeah, our guest today. David Blessing. Our friend David Blessing. Our own. Yeah. What does he do, Pete? He have heads a, up our Waves program, which is yep. part of our uh, day program, and it's uh, for folks who want a little bit more relaxed and laid back lifestyle. Yeah. Um, and he's here to tell us all about it coming Can't up wait. shortly. Yeah. Yes, Pete. All We're right. Up shortly. Yep. Should we go right to it? We'll be right back. All right, our guest today is David Blessing. He is a staff member here at PSL Services Drive, and he is in charge of our WAVES program, which is for um, folks who want a little more laid back style for their day program, and he's gonna tell us all about it. Please welcome. David Blessing. Yay! Welcome, David. Welcome, David. We're happy to have you. Yeah, well, thank you. Noel, hit it. What? Is your role at PSO Strive? I am the uh, WAVES program leader, uh, which means that uh, basically I lead a certain uh, group of people here at, the, at uh, PSO. Yeah. yeah. Who are those people? Well, they're members of the WAVES group. Yeah. Uh, the WAVES uh, group, it's an acronym that stands for Walking, Arts, Volunteering, Exercising, and Socialization. Um, and basically they're um, either consumers who've been in the system for a long period of time or generally uh, older, mm -hmm. older uh, consumers. Yeah. Well, that was kind of a little into the next one, but Jeff, go ahead, maybe there's more. Uh, can you tell us about the WAVE program? 
Yeah, other than what you just said. Well, um, even though the uh, the pace is generally slower uh, in the WAVES program um, than those that are in the active group, uh, they are uh, nonetheless very active. On Monday, we have a music therapy session. Uh, we also do culinary arts. Mm -hmm. uh, they watch a video and learn how to prepare meals. Um, most of the uh, recipes come from the American Heart Association. On Tuesdays, we do um, Qigong and Tai Chi exercises. Um, and I'm a member of the National Qigong Association, the Tai Chi Chair Association, and the Qigong Institute. So we get a lot of exercises uh, from them. And also they volunteer. Um, as an example, currently some of our consumers are volunteering at the uh, hospice in, uh, in Scarborough. On Wednesday they dance. There are two different dance sessions. One is kind of hip-hop fast and the other one is a little bit uh, slower. And on Thursday we do cheer yoga, um, which is a lot of fun. It's uh, almost like dancing in your chair. Um, some of the consumers will go swimming, some will, will bowl, um, and we have a walking group, uh, particularly when the weather's good, we do we walk on uh, the trails in the Portland Trail system. Friday we have an, uh, an art session that we do. Uh, we do a, another Qigong and Tai Chi uh, uh, section. And just to give you an example, um, we uh, just recently did a, a Discover Maine um, projects uh, from one of our for one of our odd things and they got to taste um, uh, whoopie pies and <laughs> Jeff just had a big <laughs> smile on his face. Yeah, so it was it was uh, kind of tense there for a moment, but they ate them and <laughs> and um, uh, they learned all about the the state of Maine, the state flag, and you know and things like that. And of course, I brought some moxie in. They all got a chance to nice. drink the state drink moxie. Where were we? Uh, <laughs> and we do a, a lot of uh, community interaction. That's where the socialization comes in. Uh, we've been to Wolf Neck Woods State Park, uh, also Wood, Wolf Neck Woods Farm, Ooh, love the that. Maine Wildlife Park. Uh, we just got back from a trip to the Portland Museum of Art. Ooh. Um, and primarily they, they observe the uh, N.C. Wyeth uh, exhibition that was there. Sometimes we do barbecues in the, in the summertime. Fun. Um, we usually do one in Fort Williams in addition to the, the regular one that, we, that everyone participates yeah. in. And uh, we go to the South Worth Planetarium and last year we went to Nutcracker. Oh. You know, we saw the Nutcracker at the That's Portland City Hall. You guys do a lot, huh? Well, yeah, it's just, it, generally speaking, the, the pace is much slower, but, but it's very active. Yeah. They, they really do a lot. That's um, great. So that's what Waves is um, all about. Great. Jeff, how about this one? Okay. Um, how can... Participants. Uh, how can you participate? Yeah, how can participants okay. join? Uh, join the Waves program. Well, in, in general, uh, we look for referrals. Mm -hmm. uh, oftentimes, the case manager, uh, for instance, the last consumer that we had was actually referred to by a, uh, a case manager from, from a mailing that we sent out. And uh, we just kind of uh, explained, you know, what the Waves Group is all about and the, the type of consumer that we're looking for and uh, whether they're interested in a slower pace or faster pace or that, that type of thing. So there's a little bit of screening that goes into it, but but yeah. generally speaking, it comes from uh, referrals from either the case manager, sometimes guardians uh, will we'll recommend the Waves Group as an nice. example. Cool. Noel, you've got the next question. You ready? It's a big one. Oh. Waves just um, received. received a large great grant. grant from the... Jonah. Jonah. And Elizabeth Dyer. 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 Charitable. Ch Charitable fun Foundation. Foundation. Why was th this important t to the program? And what did you see, yes. use it for? Um, well, first of all, we were very happy to get the... Uh, uh, the grant yeah. and basically all the money will be spent for uh, consumers uh, to um, have uh, more 
better things that are in the uh, the ways room or to take more uh, trips um, out into the community and and uh, just in general to make the, uh, the program better. But I'll, I'll give you an example. The recent trip that we had to the Portland Museum of Art that was actually all made possible from the uh, from the grant. Um, we uh, we started the day day with doing some chair yoga um, exercises and. Um, the grant allowed us to buy a, a laptop computer so that we could use uh, a HDMI cord to hook up to the big screen uh -huh. and they could see uh, a certified yoga, chair yeah. yoga instructor and they, and they, um, uh, they danced in their chairs and did all <laughs> from that. But, but the grant allowed us to buy that, uh, that laptop to be yeah. able to hook it up. Uh, then we went to the uh, to the museum. It allowed us to pay for admission, for parking, which is expensive uh, in Portland, and also for the first time they were actually able to eat in the uh, the restaurant, the Black Tie Company down the lower level. Um, they fed us, and it was wonderful. We even had dessert. Hey. <laughs> hey. And then on the way back, uh, we stopped off at uh, Dunkin' Donuts. They have a fireplace in the Dunkin' Donuts on Outer Carnegie Street, so we all gathered around the fireplace and we had hot chocolate and whipped cream. Mm. And then we came back and we amazing. opened up uh, boxes of various projects um, that the grant had allowed us to buy. Uh, puzzles and games and art projects and things like that. So almost all the money um, on that particular outing was spent from the, uh, from the grant. So, awesome. That's great. Yeah, yeah, that's very exciting. Jeff, back to you. You, you have, have uh, been, been passionate. I have been passionate uh, about teaching your participants, participants and Qigong. Qigong, can you tell us? what it is and why is it important? Great well, uh, per personally I've been doing Qigong for uh, quite a few years. Um, it's basically Chinese yoga. It's a form of Chinese yoga. Um, and I'll talk about a little, little bit more about it, but Qi basically stands for energy in uh, Chinese, and Gong simply means working with that energy, okay? Mm -hmm. And the Chinese believe that um, in the Chinese medical system that energy runs through channels all through your body. And when these energy channels get clogged, that's why you get sick and why you come down with disease and things like that. So the whole idea is to keep these energy channels uh, flowing. Um, also, it's based on acupuncture. Uh, I think we've all heard about acupuncturists. Um, and it has to do with um, the lymphatic system. For instance, when you do Qigong exercises, you're, you're moving, but you're not moving uh, like you're running a five-mile you know, race or something like that. Uh, but you're, you're keeping um, uh, your, these, this energy moving in your body. It also helps your lymphatic system, which releases a lot of the waste products and the toxins that accumulate in your body. Because yeah. the lymphatic system uh, is not a pump like the heart. The only way it works is is through energy and through movement. Um, and number one, I think it's made me healthier. Number two, it's an, it's an awful lot of fun. Yeah. When we do uh, the Lohan padding and they get to the point where they pat their butts, they have a lot of fun <laughs> They with do that. have a lot of fun <laughs> <laughs> There's a bladder meridian running through there. They go, <laughs> Jeff, you've been doing the Lohan <laughs> padding yeah, yeah. for a while. You didn't even yeah, know. Yeah, I know. You didn't even do it, Jeff. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's move on to the next one. Right here. It's the same thing. You have been working at PSL Strive for many years. What is your favorite part of your job? Well, I, I think that this is going on my 11th year working Ooh, for, yeah. for PSL Strive. Um, and I think the, the, the favorite part really is working with the, uh, the consumers, uh, the people that I work with every day, nothing against the staff. <laughs> but, uh, Thanks a lot. <laughs> But, but the consumers, are, they're a lot of fun. They sure are. Um, but I, I very often, I, I think I, I, I said it in one of the newsletters, I really think the consumers are awesome. Yeah. I mean, if you consider everything that they do here, 
and uh, throw in volunteering on top of it. That's enough for anyone right, <laughs> during right. the course of a week. But on top of that, when, when you really get into it, you find out that some of them actually work part-time jobs yeah. out in the community. So um, I really think they're awesome. I, I, I don't know how, looking at it, a lot of people really could not be as active uh, and could not be out there as much as uh, our consumers are. And I have a lot of respect for them. And it's, really, it's a lot of fun uh, to work with them every day. And, uh, and I, I just see that, uh, that dedication every single day. And it, it kind of makes you, makes you feel good. Mm. Great. That's a great answer, Dave. What is the hottest part? Oh, improv question. What's Where's the hardest part of your job? Yeah. Noel's going off the Noel's sheet. going off script. A uh, lot of paperwork. <laughs> 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 sure uh, is. <laughs> I do handle the paperwork for 80 some odd consumers. The, wow. the, all the, uh, the books and the forms and the state. And, I mean, there, there's really a lot, an awful lot to it. But I somehow I, I managed to, uh, to weave in a... Uh, a fire alarm every once in a while. That's <laughs> right, you do. David does our fire It kind of makes drills. me feel good. <laughs> <laughs> Great question. Anyway. Jeff, right, you Jeff, get the last video. regular question. Okay. What is your favorite PSL Strive memory? Um, I think it was in 2015, I was named the Employee of the Year. That's right. Yay. I remember that. I was quite shocked. Oh. You know, and uh, I was very, very proud of that. I, I do have the plaque at home. I shine it up. <laughs> and um, I guess that's my, my favorite memory. It's nice to be recognized. Yeah. All right, now what is it time for, Noel? The lightning round. The lightning round. All right. And as always, Jeff, Jeff kicks off the first. lightning round. Go this ahead. is an easy one, I think. Action or? Yeah, active. Uh, active or waving? Active or, or waves. Waves. Uh, yeah, good answer. Summer in Maine or winter in Maine? Summer. Good answer. Jeff? Hot coffee or iced coffee? Hot coffee. If you had a, a superpower, what would it be? Tough one. Uh, flying. Yeah. yeah. Jeff? Uh, favorite place to go on a walk in Maine? Um... Wolf Neck Woods Park. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> if you could be any color of the crayon cray crayon box, which color would you pick? Uh, green. It's the color of money. Mm. Oh, oh, good one, David. Not easy, man. That's a Whitney yes, original. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff, back over to you. Uh, favorite restaurants in May in Portland? Uh, DeMillo's. Yes. That's my family. <laughs> That's right. Silly, salty, salty, or sweet snacks. I think sweet. Mm. Last one, Jeff. Bring it home. T tell us about your best joke. Tell us your best joke. I'm not sure. I we have, have two joke books right here. If you need some references. I, I I do remember years ago I was talking to some people. I don't know if you ever heard me. I, I sometimes I'll say to people, look at it this way. Yeah, you know, people <laughs> usually neck. laugh, right? <laughs> I was talking to some people, some professional people years ago, and we, we were talking about a particular job, doing a particular job, and I kind of thought I was getting comfortable with them, you know, and so I, I was going to throw this thing out, you know, look, look at it this way. <laughs> they didn't laugh. <gasps> How could they? <laughs> I love that uh, joke. <laughs> sometimes the jokes don't work. That's right. Yeah, we know all about that. We yeah. know about <laughs> jokes not sticking in this yeah, room. Yeah, yeah. That's all right. Well, David, thank you so much for coming on our okay. show. Very good. We All appreciate right. Yes, thank it. you. And Jeff? We'll be right back. Swabcast is brought to you by... Listeners like you. Listeners, Listeners like, like... Molly and Andrew. Molly and Andrew. And Andrew. From where? A Farmington. From Farmington. Farmington. Wow, great. Thanks for listening, Molly and Andrew from Farmington. Yeah, we, we appreciate, appreciate it. it a lot. Thank you so much. And we need your help to get more people to listen. That's right, we really do. We're trying to get this show back on the road. We want to be bigger and better and have more yeah. listeners. So share this podcast with your friends. Put it on your social media pages. Tweet us, Instagram us, Facebook us. 
share us wherever you can. We, we just went over 6,100 okay, unique you listeners. So that's great, but we need to help make it bigger and better. That's right. We want to hit That's our goal 10, for 2020. 000. So plus. please share. Please leave us a rating or a comment. Yeah. Help us grow the Strivecast. If right, you know Jeff? Anybody that works at Apple, 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 I know page that, buddy. Podcast app. That would be great. All right. Any other ideas? Um, then we'll be right back. All right, we're back, and it's time for Ask Noel. No, if you have a pole, you'll where the pole is a door. This is the no. Welcome to the door. Ask Noel. All right. Pete, did we get an email today? I think we have a couple. Whoa. Um, the first one right now is from Felicia from Brunswick. Felicia, what up, girl? And she's seen the pictures of you um, coming up on the uh, Strivecast, and she'd like some... She'd like to improve her skincare routine. Oh, she's seen pictures of Jeff and Noel and yeah. likes her skin. Nice. Yeah, and yeah. wants to know what she should do to make her skin glow like you two. That's awesome. You have Thank you, advice? Felicia, for listening. Long oh, time. I know what she can do. What she can she do? Let's share it. Cleaning clear. Clean and clear? Yeah. Is that a brand of face wash? Yes. Do you use that? Sometimes. Yeah. Great. And it helps keep your face nice and clear? Yeah, and no sh- face lotion. Face lotion, like moisturizer? And chapstick. Chapstick is always good. Yeah. What kind of moisturizer do you use? Face lotion. Um, um, Aquaphor. Aquaphor. Cool. Yeah. Jeff. Jeff, do you have any skincare advice for Felicia? Uh, um, uh, I do, uh, and all of our listeners. Uh, anybody I do, uh, wants to know? Yes, I do. Hit it. Okay. Uh, um, I'll always wash your face with nice warm water. It will wake you up. Mm-hmm. And maybe before you go to bed. Yes. Great idea. And, um, and, um, keep going. Always, uh, put some uh, lotion on your face and it'll help you wake you up. All right. Sounds great. Yeah. Pete, did we get another email? I thought we did, but I don't think we do. Oh, okay. But, um, is, is this woman have bad acne? I don't know if she has bad acne, but if I think she just wants. Skin care. She, yeah, she just wants to have some nice skin. Who doesn't? Oh, what's those commercials? What commercials? Oh, I do have one. Before oh. and after. Anything okay. else? You have any advice for anybody, Noel? No, but thanks not, for listening, Garrett. We not, appreciate it. Not really. Okay. Uh, do you have an outro? Yes, Garrett. I do. Hit it. A la 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 Strapcast is brought to you by... Pick a business. Listeners like you. Listeners like you and... Joe's, Joe's Auto Shop. Whoa! Yeah. Joe's, Joe's Auto, Auto, Auto Shop. Auto and Collision Shop. That's Whoa. right. So what do you do there? If you've got any car problems, you bring it over to Joe. Yep. Joe can do everything. He is can cater. He can cook Joe every who type. Is yes. yes. Yeah. He how, does it how, all. How does he do auto? How does he do it? <laughs> Nobody knows. He is knows. amazing. Jack of all trades. Too bad he's Joe of all trades. <laughs> anyway, if you would like to take Joe's spot on our show, please, please, please we are someone. not begging, but maybe begging you to take Joe's spot. 2020 special right mm. now, ten dollars. <gasps> ten dollars. Show. We will advertise your business right here on our show. What yes. Is, that what is could right. be better than these two guys and probably Susie chiming in talking over about and over yeah and over. about how great your business is. I can't think of a better way to add. And some web mentions as yeah, well. Yeah, absolutely. Where, Social media, your, shout outs. Your business is awesome. There, there you go. That could be you. Where do we see oh. this on the phone internet? Um, people could Hopefully, see it when yeah. they look at the podcast on our social media pages. They'll oh, see the so business who's sponsoring like the episode. The cabinet. It would be yes, like the cabinet. Yep. Yeah, it would be like uh, Black no, Brothers. We haven't seen anything uh, well, we're going to get another sponsor. Coming soon. right up. We're really excited. $10 right now. Can't wait. Limited time offer. Don't miss out. I'll Email see. strivecast at pslstrive.org. Sounds and good. also, I'll, I'll always get your car wash. At, at Joe's. Joe's. Yeah. Bingo. Uh, yeah. Thank we, you. We'll be right back. Yeah. All right, 
we're back, and it's time for... Yakking. Yakking with Jeff and Pete. All right. Uh, What's on the agenda today for Yakking with you guys? Today on Yakking with you, with Jeff, it is impressions. Whoa. Jeff, you're really good Jeff at impressions. Jeff is really good at impressions. What kind of impressions? He's going to do an impression of you and Olivia and me and what Susie. About, about, oh, no. Come yeah. on. What about sea yeah. dogs or ocean people? Or you could do whoever you want. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But keep in mind, this is radio. Right. So you have, to, you have talk to talk when you do the impressions. Versus Jeff's impressions are funnier when you see them. Yeah. If you meet him at the 20th anniversary, maybe he'll do one for you Yeah. in person. In person. All okay. right. Who are you going to do an impression of? Who are you going to start first? with? Um... Uh, see, uh, uh, I'll probably do an impression of Whitney. Okay. Oh, Here all we right. Go. go ahead. Speak right into the mic. <clears throat> Hi. Hey, <I am> Whitney. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Welcome to Thrive. I don't know. What was Sounds right. exactly like Whitney. Wow. Yeah. Nice done. All right. Like Whitney slash pirate. Who is next? Who's your next impression? Um. Me. Yeah. Do it. Here's Olivia. Uh, um. My impression of Olivia is she's always perky. You know, like. <laughs> He's making a weird face and holding his hands like a woodchuck. <laughs> okay, you need to talk. Yes. What does Olivia sound like? <laughs> Olivia sounds like a, a half of the Aida. Half of a Aida? <laughs> Which half? Uh, probably the front half. <laughs> the front half of the Aida. Oh. Alright, let's hear it. Let's hear Olivia say, Olivia the Aida say something. Hey, <laughs> 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 Olivia. something like her. Yeah. <laughs> All right, who's next? I don't have it. Um, I say Pete. All right, we'll do it. Hi, I'm Pete. Sounds like a the Hulk. He, he is very funny. Oh. <laughs> Who am I talking about? He's very serious about his job. Mm. That's now it. He's taking a pen and, and writing things <laughs> down. Are you pretending you're in a meeting? Look, I'm Pete. I'm. I'm in a um, autobiography. I'm <laughs> writing my autobiography. What's the title? Um, What's the name of the book? The name of the book is uh, um, uh, it's p w w dot p well dot com. Pete oh. Oh. Great. That's Any other impressions you want to do? Dave. Um. Yeah. All right. Do you know? Yeah. Last one. Oh, I'm the hole. I fall asleep <laughs> in front of a guest. I, I can't wake up. All you drink soda. <laughs> this is his impression. <laughs> wow, that was a good you one. You got one Ryan? Yeah, do Ryan. What? Give me one Ryan. Do it. Do one to me too. Hi, I'm Ryan. That's what Ryan sounds like? Hello, I'm Ryan. Wow. I, I like going to the 25 and have to... Going to strike 25. Fun, and I do a little w w wiggle. Oh. Okay. That's Fascinating. Weird. Okay. All right. Well, this has been a great yakking with you. Oh, do you an impression Susie for good soccer. Last one. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. I don't. I don't I'm, have one for you. Susie. Do it. Do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. that's a making out impression. Oh, yeah. wow. You have to talk. You have to talk. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Mm. Nope. All right. We're going to have to go. Jeff, we will uh, be right back. <laughs> All right. We're back, and it's time for... Susie's Cues! Cues! And today's Susie's Cues, Susie's got a celebrity in mind. Yes! That just I do! Noel, Pete, and I are gonna guess in 10 guesses or less. Yeah. So, who wants to start it off? Noel? Alright, go ahead. Okay. A celebrity. Yes. Who is not here at Strive. Correct. So, what's okay. your first question for her? Is it a woman? Is it a woman? Yes. Yes, the celebrity is a woman. Okay. 
Jeff, next question. Okay. Uh, um, uh, is it, um... Is she on TV? Yes. Okay, two. Uh, is it DJ, uh, DJ Tanner? No. No, okay. Good guess, though. No, next time. You know time. who it is? I think. Oh. Yeah, then let's hear it. Dun 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 no. It's not Shannon Moss. No. Okay. Is she on a TV show? Yes. Oh. <laughs> is, is that, that, me, that was your fifth question. Yeah, I know. Is it an old show or a new show? Good That's question. not, yeah. New show. New okay. show. Okay. That makes sense. Does she have blonde hair or brown hair? Brown hair. Okay. Seven? Oh, is it Mega Trainer? No. Brown hair. Yeah. Um, oh. On TV, new on TV, show. New show oh, brown hair. New show, not old show. Um, Don't just guess. That's the thing to narrow yeah. down. Is it like a singing show? No. Oh, what no. channel is it? Is she on? Fifty-six. <laughs> what? This doesn't count the as an official question. Oh. Show. Is that the Hallmark Channel? 56? Oh boy. Hallmark. Okay. Yes. That one didn't count. 55. And you already said it's not. Um, is it. Candace can't remember. Yes. Is it the, that 70 show? No. Is that 8? 9? You're at one question. All right. Hallmark Channel. What's the last question, guys? It, is, is it she? a TV show or a <laughs> movie on the Hallmark Channel? <laughs> movie. You told me it was a TV show. I want one question back. Yeah, revoke the question. Yeah. Was she in a Christmas movie? Yes. It's gotta be her. Is it Candace Cameron Bure? Yes. Yay! <laughs> no. Who is and what movie is she in or what TV show? Do you remember the cat? Yeah. So. Yeah. <laughs> and she. What did Jen? She said Full House. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> she was on the cat show. Was plays by her by the same thing as a full house <laughs> show. Oh, wife, all right. That, yeah. That's it what Jeff hurt. just said. To My say. wife likes a lot of the uh, and she said Christmas movies. All right. What a good season. All right. That's, that's, what, what, that's what Jeff, Jeff? said. Okay. We'll, yeah. be, we'll be right back. Back and it's time to wrap, 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 it wrap it up, 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 we would be the hip hop. Pete, you never, King of the hip -hop. you never dance. Peter King of the hip hop. No one brought that up to me on Friday. He said Peter never dances. He is correct. Yeah. <laughs> All but, right. Well. Uh, but Emma Marie dances. But, but Emma Marie, Marie dances. Great. All right. Thank you so much to David Blessing, our guest today, ahead of our yeah. Waves program, for coming on and telling us all about that awesome program that we have. If you are listening and know somebody who might benefit um, from being in our Waves program, please get in touch with us. Strivecast at pslstrive.org. You are breathing mighty loud today, don't? Uh, shout out to our producing team of Whitney and Susie for uh, putting together an yet another phenomenal episode of the Strivecast. Uh, we really appreciate it. Thanks so much to our engineer Ryan for putting the show together and making us sound good. Quick turnaround, too, for this well, show. Yeah. Yes. This is a today. This is live today. Tuesday is the day. Not much tape delay today. That's right. All right. Anything yeah, else we want to talk about? Strive Gala coming up Saturday, January twenty fifth, twenty twenty. Yeah. We will see you there. Tickets available at pslstrive.com. Oh yeah. Okay. Strive Rocks applications uh, that dog. still available. Yeah. Strive U applications. That's what I said. Did I say Strive Rocks? Yeah. Strive. Strive U. As in Strive University. Yep. Uh, applications are due back by February third. Third. Monday, February third. Yeah. So it's not too late. Yeah. Let's get them in quickly. That's right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. See you next week. Peace. See you next week. Yeah. Bye.